Week one, done. Nice. And not nice. Not nice. Reynolds, you are terrible. We can't go to the sanitarium, so uh, we can't get rid of Reynolds' kleptomania. We have no healers on the stagecoach. I do like the Houndmaster. I'm not a big fan of the abominations. Do we have a stress heal on this guy? No. You will know the Let's see here. Yes, we're still poor. Excellent. This is messed up. Our two healers. High stress. We can't even get the the stress reduction. Mm, this is not looking good. I think week two just has to be a quick short run. Can I get rid of you for him? You know what? I think we can. I think we can manage. Let's try it. So we bring two shovels, 12 food, did not use anti-venom last time, so we'll stick away from that. Three keys, eight plus four torches, and we'll grab a holy water, an extra holy water, just in case. Week two is starting now. They're finally telling us about the hero panel we've been using this entire time. So we need to complete 100% of room battles, so even though this room is off along the edge, we kind of have to go here just in case. Ooh, this isn't good. Six health. Can we grape shot them? Ooh. So we have this guy actually. You can see that their bleed chance is like 40% to resist. So if we can get three of them hit. Nice, we even killed one. Nice. And we get the hounds Harry. Nice. Bleed? No! <laughs> oh no! They're definitely trying to kill me. That is definitely the intent of the people in this. Nice. So it was a room battle. I think it's a good time to use a dog treat. So we're gonna get that boost. 50% damage boost. This gives us a chance to kill. So we're gonna go for that. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. This guy's got a powerful attack. So I think we need to try and stun him. Let's go for the stun on him. Five is a solid number and a stun. Looks good. That's not good. 96. Four more! Please resist. No! It's one damage? Not a big deal. Okay. That's fine. We need that pistol shot. 73% chance to hit. Tracking shot? No. Bam! Nice. Nice. Hounds rush on this guy. 6 to 11 damage. Let's do it that way. Low rolled. Nice. Let's heal. So as long as we don't hit a 7, he's dead on his next attack. <laughs> that's not a 7. <laughs> we should have actually lowered the light level, but that's fine. We can do it now. So we open this, key it up. Ooh. Okay, let's throw that there. So it costs us 4 torches to do that, so it's not cheap. But if you get something good out of it, especially like a relic right at the start of the game, an uncommon relic at that point, it's pretty good. Especially for that plus 10 accuracy bonus. Dismas and Highwaymen in general really struggle with that last 10% that they need. Like it's always a 75% chance to hit. Are bookshelves good? I don't think so. We're not looking for anything on them. We'll leave it for now. I'll have to do some research on that. That's not good. <laughs> Week two, we're paranoid. <laughs> Sounds great. I did not want to see this afflicted tutorial in week two. So it's definitely one of the get in, get out kind of games. Her stress back down to zero, that would be blessed, but I don't think that's going to happen. So we'll just have a paranoid person for most of this. See that 10 extra, 75% chance to hit. We can also try for the kill on the Bone Courier. Courtier, sorry. The Bone Courtier got a 20% chance to crit. Or, er, 25% chance to kill, 10% chance to crit. Higher hit, hero hit rate. I think that's... Oh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Do we need to heal? I don't think so. I think 
The front people are still okay. Two. We're gonna try and get this guy. <laughs> Never mind. We're just gonna let him sit there. That's fine. Gonna use the biscuit. We're gonna use both biscuits early for this game. Really just need to get out of here. Two to three, eighty-seven. That's that's our goal. Nice, we got him. We can hit this guy. Try and stun him. We got it. Ha! Doesn't matter. We're already above a hundred. <laughs> She's definitely going out. If we can get another healer, we're shipping her off immediately. Gotta shut him up. Nice. Deadweight is fine, as long as he doesn't get moved. He got moved. Alright. <laughs> and stunned. Alright. Alright. Out of here. Open Vein doesn't do any bleed damage, but it also does a lot of damage. Never mind. I lied. It actually hit the lowest amount it could. We got it. Okay. Please don't miss. Nice. Whenever I think things are going bad, I know the ways helps. Let's take this. Oh, we got the scout. Nice. That's gross. <laughs> That's actually disgusting. Do we double back? I think we double back. I'm gonna double back. With somebody above 100 stress, we really just don't want to stay around and fight. If we can avoid fights, it's best that way. We only have five torches left, so I'm really avoiding dropping the light anymore until we have a full scout. Oh, okay. It was the same on both sides. Alright, well, guess we're going this way. That's what we don't want. He's getting a klepto ability, so we don't get any of that. I guess that mark just does nothing. <laughs> Stop yelling. Stop. Please. Just... Ugh. That's good. Might as well put him on. Wait, 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 hold up. Actually, those might be good on... the dog. Because he's he can attack in any square. So let's put him on the him, actually. Let's... You, give me the boots back. You, put the boots on the dog. There we go. We're ready. Oh, we're at this still the room battle. <laughs> oh no. Light up. The way is Let's do it. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. Nice. This does more damage overall. I think it's this. Let's do grape shot. Nice. Nice. I was hoping for a little more on this guy, but that's fine. We can make it work. We can make it work. Hounds Harry. We just need that one damage. Hero damage one. Well, that's really all we need. You know, that's a zero. I was told one. Apparently one is zero. Okay, let's go for it. That's good. We have enough health not to worry. And as long as this does one damage, like it said it would, I think we don't care. Nice! Still did zero here. And then... Bulwark. Hopefully the mark will make it so that he gets attacked. Or we can just get the pistol shot for the kill. No, that was a lie. Maybe we can get the Hounds Rush for the kill. Nice. Alright, is that the entire dungeon? Hope that's it. Remind yourself nope. Confidence so there's another room battle up ahead. Killer. Ooh. Should've healed. I really should've healed. I swear it is miss. No! Okay. This is definitely a heal round. Will Bulwark? Lick Wounds? Lick Wounds. Now the party's looking a little healthier. Uh, let's go for it. 400 gold, nice. Reynold, I swear! Okay. That's a lot of gold. If there's a chest in this room, there is not. I think we'll hold on to the torches for that final room. 
Because if there's a chest in there, we can drop the torch level like we did the first time. They all have 7 health and a low bleed chance, so we're just going to go for the Hound's Harry, I think. And they dodged. Nice. Mm, 5 to 10. We rolled a 5. Nice. Can we get any of them dead? <laughs> okay, this is going to be a really messy round. I think we just have to go for the high rolls. I'm going to regret this. Really going to regret this. Yep. Yep. That's not good. That's really not good. Things are going bad. Things are going bad. That's good. Okay. That's not good. Wow. Okay. Oh no. Uh, who still needs to attack? Good. Okay, that's one less damage attacker. Spit is bad. That hurts so much. Bite is bad. Hounds Harry, Hounds Harry, Hounds Harry. One to two. Plus bleed. Hounds Rush. Five to nine. Of course. Of course! <laughs> Heal! Nice. Okay, we gotta go for it. This is the end, hopefully. Good. Whew! Citrine goes. This comes in. Hmm. Oh, that's it. Do we stay? I think we do. Okay. And it's a trap. Nice. How much stress are you at? 155? Alright, we can keep going. Nothing here. Nice. Alright, well, we're leaving now. Oh, that affliction almost killed us. None of this is good. All of this is bad. Oh my goodness. I think this might be the worst start possible. Let's see if we have anybody in the stagecoach. We've got an occultist, that's good. We've got a man at arms, that's good. I need that pick to the face, but this is good. Stress heal? Does he have a stress heal? No, it's right there. I mean, it's not bad. If we can get him some new skills, it could work out. Let's bring him just in case. As far as I know, Basnage is done. We can't keep her. So, I think that is our first dismissal of the map. Yeah. Goodbye. It feels bad, but, you know, we're trying not to lose anybody, and if she's going to go out and potentially kill her whole team, I mean, we can't keep her around. So, hopefully we can see something better in the next week. I don't know what next week will bring, but... We'll see where this takes us. We've got a nice lineup of people. We've got that man-at-arms. We've got a jester. We've got a new healer. And some sort of damage. Maybe we'll just run these four. Let's see. Next week, we'll be going into this. We're going to try another ruins run. See if we can get anything good. Maybe we'll try a weld run. But thank you for coming along for this. Hopefully, we can get better luck on the next runs. And consider subscribing. Like and comment if you enjoyed this. And let me know if you want to see something new. We're trying out new videos, we're trying out new styles, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.